Hi, I'm Cybex author William Panic. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a network access policy. So to do this, the first thing we have to do is we have to actually open up the routing and remote access. So we're going to do that by clicking on the start button, going into administrative tools, and we're going to scroll down, and we're going to double click on routing and remote access. Now, once we're in routing and remote access, we're going to go ahead and expand the server, server A, and we're going to go to routing and remote logging and policies, and we're going to right click, and we're going to go ahead and choose launch NPS. Now, once the NPS MMC comes in, we're going to actually click on network policies, we're going to right click, and we're going to choose new. In the policy name, we're going to go ahead and just put in test policy. All right. And at that point, we're going to leave everything else and we're just going to go ahead and say next. On the specify conditions page, we're going to go ahead and we're going to click add. And what we're going to do is we're going to put in a day and time restriction. So we're going to scroll down until we find day and time restriction. And we're going to click add. Then, what we're going to do is we're going to actually, in here, put in the time of day that we're going to do our restriction. So, what we're going to do is we're going to say that you are allowed to have remote access Monday through Saturday from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. So, we're going to say permitted. And what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and say that they have access from 7 a.m., to 7 p.m. So on that point we're going to say it's declined and it's going to be 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. and we're going to say denied. We missed a few here so let's go ahead and finish those in. And now they have access Monday through Saturday but unfortunately they still have Sunday so let's get rid of that. We're going to say deny. Now they have access from Monday through Saturday from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. and we're gonna go ahead and say okay so that's what it's saying here they're actually they got access from 7 till 7 1900 is 7 p.m. so at that point we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna say next and we're gonna say that access is granted we're gonna say next when we get to the configure authentication methods this is where we choose which methods now we want to make sure that MS Chap version 2 and MS Chap regular are both done. I'm also going to make sure that Chap is included. So at that point, I'm going to go ahead and now you can also, before we click next, you can allow clients to connect without negotiating an authentication method. Let's go ahead and we'll choose that. So we're going to go ahead and click next. When the box comes up, about connection request policies, do you want to view them? We're going to say no. We don't want to uh, view the help policies at that time. What I'm going to do now is on the disconnect if idle, I'm going to set that for 60 minutes and I'm going to go ahead and say next. Then actually at the configure settings here for PPP, I'm just going to go ahead and say next. The completion, I'm going to at this point just click finished and that's it we've now set up a new policy so that they can only connect from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Monday through Saturday so I'm gonna go ahead and close this down in this video I showed you how to set up a connection policy through routing and remote access